Hey family, we have some double SSI checks going out in December and I want to share some information to you in this video regarding those double payments. A lot of people have been asking me so I figured it was a great time to take the time to explain to you about these particular payments and when they are set to arrive. Also, I want to share a story about a social security recipient that is now being asked by the government to pay them $84,000. This is a crazy story and I want to share it with you and hope I can help you protect yourself from being asked to pay the government money as well. I have the details to share with you in just a moment, but before we get started, make sure that you subscribe to the channel as well as hit the like button for the YouTube algorithm. Now let's go ahead and start with the video. Real quick, I want to go ahead and share a story with you about a social security recipient that was targeted, I guess, if you will, and now he is being asked to pay back $84,000 to the Social Security Administration. As you can see right here, this particular West Michigan man told was told that he owes $84,000 back to Social Security. He ended up later telling us that he would also be scheduled to lose his Social Security entirely. Uh, take a look at this particular story right here. Dave Wilder says he received a letter from Social Security saying that he was overpaid during the pandemic. Now, three years later, he was told he owes $84,000 and that his Social Security payments will be cut off. Please, I just didn't know what to do. He didn't eat for almost two days. He was so depressed and scared. We're both scared. It's like, what do you do when all of a sudden you're income is ripped out from under you. Rose and Dave Wilder said they only felt sheer panic when they received a letter saying he was overpaid by Social Security and they expected to be paid back $84,000. Then I got this letter saying they were going to cut me off entirely. Dave Wilder has been on disability since 2012. While working part time, he says he has always worked within the limits and filed everything correctly. He is now on regular Social Security but was told he was paid $84,000 when he should have been paid zero. And the lady told me straight out that during COVID, they weren't allowed to send any notifications out for anything or to change anything. Well, that doesn't make any sense to me. If, if I was making too much money, why did they keep paying me every month? Mm -hmm. You know, so, you know, if it finds that some months I was over and I have to pay that back, I'm fine with that. They have worked for decades, raised their two children, and watched their grandkids grow, but they have now become overwhelmed by uncertainty. It's day by day now. You know, whether I'll still be hanging on by my fingernails when I turn 70 and have to keep working longer yet to try to get my finances in order. He has been given forms to fill out to state that it would be a financial hardship to pay back this amount and lose his social security. It angers them to also know they are not alone. I don't leave people hanging. Don't, don't do that to people. You know, send them a letter, you know, three, four years later and say, hey, you owe all this money to us, you know. The Social Security Administration says that every person's situation is unique and every overpayment is handled on a case-by-case -case basis. If you receive a notice for an overpayment that you disagree with, you can file for an appeal as well as request the agency to waive the collection of the overpayment. In the studio, I'm Jeremiah Brown, 13 on your side. Yeah, as you can see, that was pretty crazy to hear this particular story. I mean, it could just sneak up on you out the blue, not even knowing that this could actually happen. Uh, so yes, I just want to make you guys aware of what's going on right now. Social Security has been overpaying a lot of individuals for years, many years now, and they are coming back later, as you see this particular guy coming back 11 years later asking for a repayment because they decided to pay him more money than he should have been receiving. Receiving. So anyways, I just want to make you aware of what's going on in case you receive a letter out there. Like the guy said, you do have an opportunity to appeal that uh, notification from the Social Security Administration office. But anyways, I just wanted to keep you guys informed and hopefully you guys will stay safe out there. Uh, moving on, we do need to go ahead and talk about some Social Security checks that are on the way. We are talking about some double payments that some individuals are going to be receiving. As you can see right here, that Social 
Social Security checks up to $4,555 are expected to arrive next month, uh, the last month of the year. Are you guys excited for 2024? Uh, well, hold on. Let's get through Christmas first. But uh, anyways, we're going to be talking about exactly who and why they're going to be receiving these double payments next month. Uh, as you can see that some Social Security beneficiaries may be entitled to receive up to $4,555 each month. Uh, but each month, millions of beneficiaries receive money from the Social Security Administration office, many of them either retired workers or even survivors. The Social Security Administration office also sends out disability benefits, which include the SSI program and the Social Security Disability Insurance, or better known as the SSDI. But the amount of payments vary from beneficiary to beneficiary. SSA calculate payments on an individual basis based on various factors. Uh, for retired workers, payments are affected by age. Also, benefits change each year due to the cost of living adjustment. This year, average payments from SSI program around $550 per month. The maximum monthly SSI benefit is up to $914 for an individual and $1,371 for a married couple, where both spouses are eligible for the program. Uh, but anyways, meanwhile, retirees' median monthly payments rose to about $1,827 revealed by the Social Security Administration office at the start of the year. Uh, the maximum benefit for those who retire at age 62 is $2,572 a month and $3,627 for workers who retire at the full retirement age around 67 years old. And individuals who delay retirement until the age of 70 years old are eligible for a maximum benefit of $4,000. $555 if they meet the work and the income requirements. So anyways, like I said, these particular payments are expected to start next week or this week rather uh, because December the 1st is this Friday. But anyways, it says that why you will get the two social security checks in December? Uh, well, it is all about the people are in the spirit of giving. <laughs> Just kidding, guys. The Social Security Administration office will be sending out these two checks for the month of uh, uh, December as long as it's the right kind kind of check uh, okay with the administration office, which they have not taken on the role of Santa Claus. I know you were getting a little bit excited, but anyways, the agency typically sends out these two checks in the same month uh, once every now and then, depending on when the end of the month lands on the weekend. Uh, yes, these particular two checks will be issued to people who qualify for the SSI benefits. The first SSI check will be issued this Friday on December the 1st, according to the SSA. The second check will be issued four weeks later on Friday, December the 29th. And this is all because of the quirk in the payment schedule. Uh, SSI beneficiaries get two payments in March, June, September, and December, while no payments are deposited in the months of January, April, July, and October. One check is issued during the remaining four months. The extra payment in December can be considered as an advance for the next following month of January. And yes, this second check for the month of December on December the 29th is all because January the 1st falls on a weekend and typically the SSA does not issue any type of checks or monthly payments on the weekend, such as Saturday or Sunday. So because January the 1st uh, lands on the weekend, they are going to advance that particular check just a few days early and pay it out on the end of the month, which pretty much falls on a Friday. So uh, that is exactly why some individuals are expected to receive uh, two SSI payments on the beginning of the month as well as the end of the month of December. So yes, this is going to affect millions of Americans out there who are expected to receive their SSI benefit payment uh, for the month of December. And as you see right here, it says that in 2023, the federal maximum SSI benefit rate is $914 for an individual and $1,371 for a couple. Those amounts will rise next year. Uh, be mindful of that. Uh, this is going to be the increase amount that has already been calculated and expected 
in the year of 2024, the new amounts will be $943 for an individual and $1,415 for a couple. So uh, anyways, but like I said, you need to at least get through the month of December because those are going to be the last time that you are going to be receiving an amount in SSI benefit amount of around $914 for individual and $1,371 for a couple. So uh, anyways, be mindful of that. But the good news is that these increases are going to be happening next year, starting in January, which I will say that you're not going to be receiving those because it's going to actually happen in December, but officially those payments are going to be starting in February. Be mindful of that because you are going to be receiving your increased payment in February for 2024. Like I said, the payments are going up, uh, going up around $30 for individuals and uh, $45 for couples. This is some great news. We are excited to hear this. This is all because of the previous cost of living adjustment or the COLA increase that we were notified earlier in October uh, what those increased amounts are going to be for uh, Social Security beneficiaries. This is some awesome news. And uh, like I said, I love to see this. But uh, anyways, you need to be mindful of that. Those double payments are going to be coming for December, which is going to help you uh, if you participate in any Christmas shopping or uh, things of that sort. But uh, anyways, I at least want to give that information to you. Hopefully all this information in this video was helpful to you today. Well, anyways, that's all we have for you today, but feel free to check out some of the items down below in the description. There are a couple of opportunities for you to earn some free money or some free cash, such as signing up with Rakuten, which is the number one cashback website out there, which you can receive money on your purchases that you are making at your favorite store, such as Adidas, Nike, even Target. But anyway, right now they are giving an additional bonus after you sign up you can receive a $40 bonus just for signing up and using it for the first time so it is a great way for you to earn some free money as well as earn money on top of your purchases that you are making right now as Black Friday is coming to an end but Cyber Monday is starting on Monday I know a lot of you are going to be spending a lot of money out there so be sure to take advantage of the opportunity also don't forget about signing up for the Amazon Prime membership where you can get 30 days for free, which is a great time to get all of your Christmas shopping as well as some of your grocery items. Get them delivered to your home for totally free. Anyways, those links will be down below. But anyways, if you enjoyed today's content and you want to see more, please go ahead and subscribe to the channel. It's totally free. And if you like today's video, then go ahead and hit the like button for us. It really helps out this channel as well as it tells YouTube to share this video with others. But anyways, I would appreciate it if you guys uh, go ahead and hit the like button and the subscribe button and I hope to see you on the next video. Peace.